OK, the next phase is to bring that into any curved letters. So let's do a C, up, touch, over, back round, touch, and a tail. And again, up, touch, over, back round, curve, and a tail. Up, touch, over, back round, a curve, and a tail. Now notice how slowly I'm doing this. The speed is crucial. You must go slowly. Okay? Very important. Right, moving on to the next letter. That would be a letter A. Now again, we start with this part. And we'll do this part. And then we'll do the letter A. Now the letter A, up, over, back round, straight up, straight down, tail. Up, over, back round, straight up, straight down, tail. Up, over, back round, straight up, straight down, tail, and so on. Now the speed again is crucial that you do it slowly to make them all the same. If you find that your stick is straight up and down rather than leaning, that's absolutely fine. You can see how slow it is, but the quality that you develop in your muscles sorry in your presentation and the quality that you develop in your muscle mind linkage is is um, very very strong so let's do the next letter and that's going to be a D because obviously that's got a stick so up over back round straight up straight down D now I'll do a straight up and down one okay, instead of leaning let's have another little look at that one so Okay, the camera might shake a bit because I'm holding it in my other hand. So let's just do another one the way I do it. Up, over, round, straight up, straight down, tail. I'll try and do a vertical one this time. Up, over, round, straight up, straight down. Okay, now you might have noticed that I haven't taken a D right to the top. The D really should come about halfway to two thirds of the way up of the line. That's the size of a D. You may have been shown to go to the top, and that's fine. But for classical handwriting, you need to have it about halfway. In fact, I'll make it a little shorter. Up, over, back, round, up, down. About there is probably better for a D. Okay, but if you just keep it a little bit short, that's fine. This is the best D so far. Okay, apart from that gap there between the on the lead up. These lead ups, incidentally, are crucial for when you start to join your writing. Okay, that's enough for this session, on to the next video.